Welcome to Resman Help. In this session we provide an overview of the Process Multiple Selected Jobs facility and the Complete Jobs routine in Resman. There's separate help videos available for providing an overview of the features and benefits of Process Multiple Selected Jobs and we suggest viewing this in addition to this video. All the Process Multiple Job Selected videos contain a word of caution on this process, as whilst we can use the process to automatically enter data into empty work fields, the process will also overwrite any existing data and this process can't be undone. So clearly uh, we need to have some caution when we're doing our filtering for data. Completing multiple jobs in a single operation will save time uh, and the skill is in identifying the jobs where the, where the work resolution is the same. Now an example of how we might want to use the complete jobs routine could be that we've created a batch of jobs to deal with a manufacturer's recall and the work has now been carried out and we can complete all of the jobs within that batch in one operation. Now, given that we've uh, entered a batch of data, we can't actually identify that on the summary list, but we can on the work detail list. So I'll swap lists, and then I'll scroll to the last column in that, which is batch number. We can already see some batch 11, which is what I want to filter for, so I'll click on that. And that's now found four records, which is what I was expecting to be able to complete. So I'll click on select all, process selected jobs, I'll click on complete jobs, and then I can click on the complete jobs button. However, if I did that at the moment, without having any work performed in there or any performance indicator chosen it would actually pop up a message as we've got here indicating that I need to take a further action. So I don't want to continue, I'll say no and I'll say that we actually completed those within our service level agreement and I'll put in the text relating to this manufacturer's recall that we've carried this out uh, as per, per that advice note and I simply click on complete jobs. At that point uh, the completion dates and times are automatically set as if we were completing a single job so based on any work dates and times entered so if I view these selected jobs now we can see that our work status is completed and in our feedback you can see that our start and end times are recorded with today's date and times. So this concludes the overview of the process multiple selected jobs facility and the completed jobs routine in Resman.